So last Tuesday, I randomly left work early to spend the evening in Chicago. Why, Maya? Why would you leave work early just to go to Chicago for one night? In the middle of the work week? Well, that question can best be answered by this footage from the trip. Hello! It is Tuesday, February 5th, um, about 4 o'clock in the afternoon, and I am on my way to Chicago. I'm going down to the uh, Century Cinema in downtown Chicago to go see uh, the premiere of the documentary Please Subscribe. Please Subscribe is a documentary filmed by Dan Doby. He's created this film in collaboration with a whole bunch of other YouTubers. Daily Grace, Hannah Hart, Wheezy Waiter, Mitchell Davis, Mystery Guitar Man, C. Nanners. He's basically made a documentary on YouTubers and what it is to YouTube tried to submit it to Sundance, uh, but they wouldn't take it. This documentary is now being distributed to a lot of independent cinemas. They're only showing it for one night in the cinemas, which happens to be today, the, the night of February 5th uh, at 7.30 nationwide. They have it at, you know, something like 250 cinemas across the nation, but the one that I wanted to go to is Century Cinema because Wheezy Waiter will be there. I mentioned Wheezy Waiter on this channel before in this video right here. Wheezy Waiter, uh, also known as Craig Benzine, is a YouTuber based in Chicago. He's just like one of my favorite content creators on YouTube. Just a funny guy. He's gonna be at this screening tonight, so I might get a chance to meet him. I was thinking about your video, Sarah, um, on Pondering Time a couple weeks ago. You're talking about basically like living in the moment, and just doing things that aren't part of the daily routine. I thought a lot about it since then, and I've decided that I'm gonna try to do different things, you know, things that I wouldn't normally do, like drive to Chicago in the middle of a work day to see a documentary on YouTubers. Normal Maya would never do this, but I don't know. It's, it's something different. The drive to Chicago was relaxing, if a bit lonely at times, so I tried to keep myself entertained by dancing to music. Yeah, I danced to Kesha. And yelling every time I had to come across another toll booth. My tolls, no! I'm not made of quarters, Illinois. Oh well, look, we've officially hit Chicago traffic. Yay! After spending a long time in the rush hour traffic of Chicago, I finally made it to the cinema. About 70 people showed up to the screening, ranging from ages 10 to 40. Then the movie started, and I obviously couldn't film that. After the movie ended, the lights came on and Craig was in the audience, so I plucked up the courage to go say hi to him. Hello, St. Elmo's Fire. This is Craig, some hey. guy that makes videos on the internet. You hey. might have heard of him. Hey, St. Elmo's Fire. Is, is this a camera? Is this video? <laughs> What's this? What? <laughs> yeah, so go check out his channel, youtube.com slash wheezywaiter. Thank you. Subscribe to St. Elmo's Fire. And we're back to the good camera. After the movie ended, um, I saw Craig, and he saw my, my uh, hoodie that I was wearing. It said Badgers, and so he's like, oh yeah, you're from Wisconsin? I'm like, yeah, I am. And we high-five, because we're both Badgers. I feel like when you meet proper celebrities, like famous authors or actors or something, you only know them for their work, and like you don't know really much more about how they are as a person. It's so much easier to like idolize those people, you know? With Craig, it, it felt more relaxed. Cause it's like, oh, here's this guy like, you know, that I, I see three times a week on my computer screen. Like, I can't, I can't feel like I know him, you know? Um, and so it, he, he seemed a lot more accessible because of that. I was still like super nervous to meet him anyway. Rather than play the role of like excited fangirl, I was just gonna be like, oh, I'm just gonna act cool, act casual. What ended up happening is I just came off, I think, as disinterested. I really didn't want him to, you know, see me as that because I really do love his videos. I love you, Craig. It was awesome to meet him and it was totally worth driving down here. I have to drive back up to Madison now and go to bed because I gotta work tomorrow. Keep six miles. Keep left onto I-90 West. Thanks, GPS. That was my experience. Deciding to drive to Chicago on a weeknight is something different. I like this sort of spontaneity. Damn it, I have to pay the toll! 